Qatar's health minister has been ranked in Forbes' top healthcare leaders 2023 list. Iran says everything is ready for a prisoner exchange with the US, which the US has denied. All Mu'assalat buses operated in the Pearl are now green. And finally, Qatar's men's volleyball team are all set to try and qualify for the Paris Olympics. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top story. Qatar's Minister of Public Health, Dr. Hanan al Khwari, has been ranked as the third top healthcare leader in the region on Forbes' top healthcare leaders 2023 list. This comes after Dr. al Khwari ranked eighth place in Forbes' 100 most powerful businesswomen 2023 just last month. Dr. al Khwari has contributed to Qatar being applauded globally for the country's success in responding to the COVID-19 pandemic. Iran's Foreign Minister Hussein Amir Abdullahia has claimed that a prisoner exchange deal with the United States is imminent, with both sides allegedly reaching an agreement. However, a spokesperson for the White House National Security Council has denied that any agreement has been reached, stating that Iran is making up the claims. Qatar has been involved in mediation talks being held between the two states, in which a prisoner exchange was discussed in September last year during the UN General Assembly. Now, Moa Salat has announced that all buses operating in the Pearl have been converted to electric buses. The change of buses has been implemented to three Metrolink routes and eight PVR buses. The conversion of the buses aims to boost eco-friendly public transportation in Qatar in line with the 2013 national vision. And finally, Qatar's men's volleyball team has made the grade for the FIVB Volleyball Qualifications Tournament for the 2024 Olympics in Paris. The Gulf State's volleyball team will battle for their place at the Olympic Games qualifiers, where six teams will have a chance to secure their tickets to Paris next year. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website, www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.